Hey, happy campers. Todd here at Great American RV Superstores. Here we are in the month of April. Beautiful weather. It's springtime. It's time to knock that pollen off of that unit and get to camping. So every Sunday this month, we're going to give you a few tips about how to get your unit out of that winter storage and get rolling. So big, big thing we want to concentrate on is tire pressure, all right? Make sure that we have the correct tire pressure. It can be found on the labels uh, on the side of the unit and then the door jams on motorized units. All the units have it, so it's an important component when you're traveling down the road. It can be very costly if a uh, tire blows out and causes a lot of damage. So check that tire pressure, make sure it's accurate. We want to check our tread and also make sure that we don't have any dry rotting or anything on the side. You can learn how to check your DOT date and make sure that that tire isn't overly aged as well to where it needs replacement. Number two on the list, AC filters. How often have you checked them, cleaned them? Do they need to be cleaned? This is a very important component when it comes to staying cool in these hot summers is making sure that your AC doesn't have any restrictive flow. So we want to check at your AC inputs. There's a lot of different types of ACs out there. So it all depends on which one you have in regards to what it looks like. And you can see a few types here. This one in particular that we're looking at is a replaceable type filter. Other ones that you see are a foam type filter where you can remove it, clean it, and insert it back into the AC. So depending on the type of AC unit you have determines where the location of that filter is. Make sure that you find it, you clean it, you replace it, whatever's necessary so you have a good working AC for these hot summers ahead. Last tip of the day, windshield wipers. Important on every single motorized unit. If you have one, you want to go check your windshield wipers, especially if you used it during the winter time. If your windshield was iced over or anything, it can tear up those blades on the front. Uh, you want to make sure that they're not dry rotting, falling apart. It's an easy thing to purchase and replace, so don't wait until you're in a bad storm to find out you got a bad set of blades. We appreciate you watching our videos and tune in next Sunday for the next springtime tip here at Great American RV Superstores. Making memories one weekend at a time.